Hello and welcome back to another episode of Agrarian Skies and today we are going to be automi uh, well, automating our sifting process of getting ore so we'll get all this stuff. That I will do for in the next episode instead because it will take far, uh, far too long to do both in one episode. And I've already got some of it set up. I've got all the stuff in here. All I need to go do is get all the stuff behind set up. So firstly, I will need to do this. So far, get all the item ducks on the end of each of them. I'm going to move this torch. I might not have to. I don't have to. It's good. No. So I'll put the torch back. So we need to set Thomas activator down there. And one down there. And this will we will be filling with cobblestone, so we will need to this um, I need a, a crescent hammer so I will be back when I get that and we are back and I've got my crescent hammer so I will need to do that and I'll make it come out can I do something can I not connect that's the only thing can I make them not connect hmm good idea Take off this one, Let's get this block, and we do this like so. Put that into there. This is where all our, all our cobblestone is, so that will go through to here, into here. Which I just turned around for some apparent reason. There we go. So that will actually get a stack to demonstrate. Well, actually, when you set down the vacuum hopper first, so set down a hopper here. And if we set that to configure for the front of it, yep. So we need a chest, which I do not have on me. I am not prepared as I thought I was. And let's get some wood. Let's get another piece of wood. I forgot to get it in the barrel inside. There we go. We got one more. So. Turn them into wooden planks. And let's do that. Right, there we go. So now we will get a stack. We won't put them in yet. We need to put the hammer in, like so. Put it to left click. So I want the right click, yep. Yeah. <clears throat> and we will need to get our chest in the front, like so. And we will need to get this going out to our sieve or another Thomas activator, which will right click this sieve with the gravel. We need to configure that so that it comes out of this. So yep, we'll see if it works up until this point. So we've got a stack of cobblestone. Yep, there we go. It breaks. It goes into the vacuum hopper, which goes into the chest. Right, so this is what our pneumatics, pneumatic server is for. So that means that we will blacklist gravel. Should go in there, I think. Should. All right, that should be working now. Should be. Right, let's get our back 
Steam Hopper set up here. And we'll set it here. And that will do. Bake it there. Yep. And then we will need to get another chest. Which I'm not prepared for. And we will go up to the tree. And we need to go out and get some more wood. There we go. Let's just make a chest up here. Just for quick reasons. So now we will need to. Is that working yet? No. Should be right clicking though, just in case. Let's go 40. Stick out up to 56. Crap. Um, there we go. Take the gravel out of it. It's over dictionary now. It should be it. Is it not? It's ignored. I don't know. Barry takes it out of Stuck. No, I'm not. Let's do it right. So, let's see. Let's put a pneumatic servo in it. That should, well, let's put some gravel in there actually. Just because. Let's see if it works at least. Seriously. Right. Um, get it off the hand, and then let's put that in there. Blacklist. I think blacklist means that. Let's see how this works. And that's working. It is working. I just need to. I don't know how this works. Um, put it down to one. Let's see if it works if we put it down to one. Is that it? Let's turn all these on. Just in case. Let's turn all them off. I don't know why that isn't working. Should work. Let's see if it works if I change it to like. Oh, I'm getting low on hunger. Well, you probably have to check it because I don't have a clue. Should work. I've got to follow the right configuration. That's damn good. Cobblestones out of there. All I need to do is get the autonomous activator working, just wired up into this pile, and then we'll, we'll get loads of ores. Hmm. Blacklist. Blacklist means it doesn't, it's a whitelist. Pretty sure that's what it means. I'm 
Ich werde es wieder. No one. Oh, but that's the folder for some. Right, so let's backlist it. No, I'll have to check that out, so I will be back with you in a second. Okay, and we are back, and we have finally got this working. As you can see, I don't think uh, it didn't work for taking it out of the barrel, but I just put a chest there, just filled it up with coals, and now we're getting we're getting somewhere with this. So that's breaking that. Well, that uses durability, does it? They use durability. See if it does. Oh, that goes in there. It was because I had the redstone signal high, because that's what it automatically does. That's sifting. Let's get into there. And it goes into here. Goes all the way through these things. Oh, yeah, look how much redstone I got. From just that one stack of never rack over. Like, if I put this in here, like, you get one, you get 24 from one. Let's do this quickly and go have another check. If I do this, if I put that is orange, orange, yeah. Shouldn't it? Not take that out. Just a case. Oh, it's smelting up never. Well, it's working now. It's working its way, so happy this is working now. And then I'm getting some more on the forge. 13 diamonds and 7 animals, so hopefully that'll be a lot. Um, I'll show you what I've done to the thing. I've made, I've added some sprinklers. I've made these tomatoes. Well, I had tomato seeds in the last one, so I just planted loads of tomato seeds down, and some of them will go in quicker than others, and then you can just right-click them, and that'll be you. The thing is, it's such a growing tree. What? I didn't even plant these trees. Okay. Good job, Sprinkle. I get this. Um. I'm here. I'm gonna really need to sort out this chest. Okay, so let's see. Let's see, for the whole thing. Can't do that yet. Good flow. Definitely can't do that yet. That's the ME things. And the fragging rights. Um, we're getting quite close for this one. Sawmill, induction smelter, fluid transposer. 
cyclic and assembler, energetic infuser, transmusher and nullifier. So let's see. Sawmill, what does it take to make a sawmill? If you want to get rid of that, um, it's just O. Sawmill. And let's see. Invarax, wood, copper, redstone, reciprocal coil, and the machine frame. Well, um. Do we have glass? Do we have cobble? Cobble way downstairs. Oh, jeez, that was close. Are you in here? Maybe blow up my elevator? The door open? No. Oh, as you can see, I'm getting XP. Great, and that's if I kill them. So, the hopper has two functions to catch. Like, you can choose that. And that. And then it's going to fill that with the good. So, let's see if we can make this then. One of these. Four of these. We need two of these actually. Get some red. Two redstone should be enough, I think. Yeah. I need copper. Copper is upstairs. Copper. And copper is. Uh, let's break that block of copper. I need to get barrels for these. Oh, we only need two copper. This is the way. Need two wood. I need an invar as well. All up here. Is there any invar? There's invar blocks. That's good. I need three. And let's go up and get some wood. Let's do that. I don't think I needed that much. I did not need that much. Let's make our own more axe. Might as well get one of these out of the road. While I'm waiting. And we need to cobble. So let's get some cobble. Need a hammer. We'll make a hammer. We'll make a crafting station down here as well. Because we're going to be mostly down here. Just set it here. For now, let's make ourselves a hammer. A cheap hammer. Could have made an iron one. One, two, three, four. And let's just turn this off as well. Just so I mean. Away, so oh, I need to break this again. Okay, just put full gravel from the machine. And later on, I'm going to be hooking the, the mace extruder up with the cobblestone. Make it in there, so it'll just be an endless cycle, and we'll get loads of ores. So, so right, where are we? That should smelt it up pretty fast. Let's get some food before we start. Because as soon as you hit zero food, you can have a like, endless supply of carrots. Need another gold one? I'm talking about two reds, two for the reception coil. I always get this mixed up. There we go. So, reception coil, two of these, that, 
planks and an ember axe and that makes our sawmill. So we just put that on top and we need to get another lead stone which we have over here. Another lead stone. And let's just put this on top. And bottom, just change that to that. Yep, that's right. So the sawmill, we put some wood just for demonstration reasons. Let's just grab like ten. So um, this would just be getting forty, just by turning it into planks. But if you put it in here, you get six each time and a bit of sawdust. So it's always good to have. So, put it down. Let's grab all this. This is just from the redstone ore I got. Keep a stack of it, just in case. We need it for something later on. 49 stacks. Whoa. Let's put the in here. So, there's 60. 10 sawdust. It's pretty... It's pretty easy to make planks and it'll be easier for me to build. Or get building materials. So let's check on this and look like that. So we just need an induction smelter for the transposer cyclic assembler energetic energetic infuser machinist workbench, which is like auto craft stuff, I think it is. A terrain smasher and a nullifier. So yeah. It's doing its thing. Very red. Look how red it is. Why is that? Oh, right, that's okay. <laughs> Just wondering why it was so red. Pretty cool. You can delete that item thing, so you only have 85, and we'll have 94. Pretty good. So, um, as I said, in this episode, we were going to be doing the farming. So, um, hope you enjoyed this episode. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you all next time. Bye.